everyone. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Delene and today I have a secondhand bag that I found at a resale shop. What I do is I usually take a bunch of my clothes and take it to the resale shop and I try to tell myself, nope, I'm returning stuff or I'm selling things. Do not buy anything. But the lady, when I dropped it off, she says, hey, um, you're, you know, we can take your clothes now. So I was like, sure. So because I knew she took my clothes, I stood around and I was looking around at the bags. <sighs> Big mistake. Now I'm selling stuff and then I'm bringing something back. But <laughs> you guys, I'm very excited with what I got. So you guys, if you're interested in seeing what I got, stick around. And also don't forget to subscribe because as a content creator, it is so important for me to grow. And also don't forget to click on that bell for notification. So you guys will be notified for every video that I release. So you guys, here we go. I'm going to show you the bag. But before I do that, I have to show you the bag that I was carrying earlier, my bag of the day. It is my coach camera bag. You guys, it is a gorgeous bag. I get tons of compliments on this bag all the time. I, it's just the colorway of these two. I think it just catches people's attention. And you know me, I love pink. So this is a beautiful coach camera bag and I've probably had it for maybe two years and I have you know, enough bags where I rotate it. So I don't always use this bag, but I do love it. And I have used it a few times. Um, it is just the perfect bag. I went to my friend's house today to go uh, see her mom. I did sell her mom the house that she's living in. And um, so it was really nice to go see my client once again, my good friend's mother. And um, she is doing really good. She is 80 years old and decided to buy this house. I was like, mm, okay. Uh, but her grandson does live in the house with her because he helps take care of her. Um, so it's, it's, I was really, really, really nice to see her. So usually when I go to a friend's house, I don't always want to carry my Louis Vuitton because I just, I just don't. I just, I'm just not always like that. And I know I got two new Louis Vuitton bags, which I am crazy about, you guys. I'm so crazy about these two bags, my denim one and my, my Speedy 20 that I just got. Oh, love them both. Now there's a big difference in size, but you know, I wanted one big one and I wanted a smaller bag. So, but anyways, this is my bag of the day. There we go. And now let me go ahead and show you the bag that I purchased at the resale shop when I was supposed to be selling things, okay? <laughs> you guys, here you go. How beautiful is this bag? It is such a pretty bag, the colorway. Come on now, look at the colorway on this gorgeous bag. So as you guys can see here, this is suede. And it is, it just looks so pretty. I don't know how old this bag is, but whoever had it took good care of it or they just didn't use it much. Cause look at the leather on here too. It looks great. I mean, it's not stuffed, so it's kind of hard to see that it's real pretty, but it is a pretty bag. There is no corner wear at all. None, no corner wear. The leather looks amazing. Look at that. And I already cleaned this bag. I've had this bag for a week already and I just haven't had chance to record it because of the fact that my husband, uh, he ruptured two of his discs down below in his neck and I have been having to completely cater to him. So it's been kind of rough. I have to drive him. He can't even drive. He can't even lay down. He could barely even sit for a long period of time. It's just really, really hard on him. Um, he is going to end up having surgery due to that fact. Right now he's on some high dose medication, but um, I'll tell you one thing, it's not 100%. He's better. He's a lot better, but he's not 100%. So just to let y'all know. Anyways, forget that. I'm going to be talking about this bag. So anyways, so the suede on this bag looks gorgeous, right? Look at the back of it. It's gorgeous. What a gorgeous color. I think it's a chocolate brown with a little bit of undertone of 
maroon or plum. I don't know, but it, it is gorgeous. And there is a beautiful back pocket here. I mean, what a great size. You don't even have to open your bag to get your phone out if you want to put it in your bag. I mean, this is just amazing. And it's got a snap closure here. So you can just snap it. And of course, it's got the coach tag there. And everything just looks great on this bag. Now the strap is adjustable and look at that. So if you guys, if anyone knows what year this bag is, I would like to know because I'm not sure. I did see one bag on eBay, I think, and it has a different colorway. It's like turquoise and brown or whatever. And it's gorgeous. Um, now that bag was going for $100, you guys. Now this bag, I paid $30 for it. So I'm very, very excited about this piece. Um, let me go ahead and show you what the inside is like. So you gotta open up this. It's got a snap closure here, which is great. And um, it's a zip, it zips closed. And it's got two pockets on the inside, but it fits the cell phone size that I have. So I know this bag is not a vintage bag because if it was it would be a smaller pocket but there's two of them and then there's also a zip close a zip pocket here where is it yeah a zip pocket in here so that's nice so I got this zip pocket and then two of the smaller pockets off to the side where I can put my phone or lipstick or my you know my um card holder whatever but most likely I would be putting my phone back here in the back pocket. And the inside, you guys, is completely clean. I know it's hard to see, um, but it is completely clean. It is gorgeous in there. It's lots of room. And the color of the inside is the same color as um, back here. So, I mean, there is a little bit of, cause I already cleaned this with leather cleaner. There is a little bit of dirtiness here, but I guess it's because the, the suede is lighter here. So this is the only place that it's actually showing some dirt. And um, when I tried to clean it with the leather cleaner, it didn't come out. So if, if anybody has any suggestions on how to clean suede, um, let me know because I this is would be my first bag that has suede on it that I can remember. <laughs> and um, it does have a couple of scratches here. And I don't know if these scratches came from being in the store or if it was used because it's like a light little scratch right in the front. But you guys, this bag is gorgeous and I am loving this bag. Let me go ahead and show you what it looks like on. There you go. Look how cute that looks. I am loving this bag, you guys. It is so, so pretty. It is, I don't know. It looks like it's from the 70s, but I don't think it is because looking at the date code, which I think I know the these numbers down here kind of tell you how old they are. And I think, I want to say it's from 2017. I don't know if that's what that means, you guys. If someone can tell me what those numbers down here mean, um, it would be great to know because I don't know if this is saying it's 2012 or 2017. I'm just really not sure. But um, like I said, I only saw one on eBay. And I try to look up an, um, you know, on other websites and I didn't really see this bag, but on eBay, I don't know if it's still on there, but uh, look at this gorgeous piece, you guys. I'm very, very, very happy with this bag. So happy. But I only used this bag once so far. I have owned it for a, a week, week and a half, two weeks. Again, I'm really not sure. Time has been kind of crazy for me because of the fact uh, my husband got injured and he has not worked in um, for a while already. It, it's about a month already, but 
Um, hopefully he'll get his schedule, his surgery scheduled eventually, and uh, we can move on with our lives. I can't wait. But um, he, he, like I said, he's on medication, so he is able to move around. It's just when nighttime comes, you know, it. Um, he can't sleep. He can't really sit for a long time. But I'm telling you, this, this ruptured disc took him to his knees, you guys. It took him to his knees, and I have never seen him like this. It kind of surprised me because my husband's a very big manly man and for him to go through that was just shocking. So anyways, you guys, thank you guys for watching my channel. I so appreciate my uh, subscribers and anybody who watches my channel. You know, I just appreciate you guys so much, but it would be nice if you subscribed. Um, it is important for me as a content creator. So if you guys can do that, I would really appreciate it. And also, and once again, you guys don't forget to click on that bell for notification and you guys have a wonderful day and God bless you. Bye.